Hey there guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I wanna show you how to factory reset your Roku TV. So I do have an ONN Roku TV. I am returning it back to the store, so I do need to remove my account information as well as all the apps that were included with it. So to do this, it's a pretty simple process. You want to scroll down to your settings menu. Once you get to settings, you wanna go down to system. Once you're in system, you wanna go down to advanced system settings. And once you're there, you'll see a couple options. So you can factory reset, network connection reset, device connect or control by mobile apps. And we're gonna to go to the factory reset setting. And then you have two options here. You can either reset audio and picture settings or you can reset everything. So as you can see what it says here, it's asking me to type in a code and then that will confirm I want to uh, reset it to original factory settings and remove all accounts. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and type in this code. So it says, please enter code 3262 to reset everything to original factory settings and remove all accounts. So we'll go ahead and type that in. And then once you've typed that in, you can go ahead and select okay. All right, and it says, if you factory reset your TV, you'll need to pair your remote and devices. For more help, visit go.roku.com slash reset. You have the option to start factory reset or cancel. So you have multiple confirmations to either do this or not do this. So we'll go ahead and hit yes, we're gonna do that. It's gonna restart the TV and it's going to now reset the software, remove all of your accounts and all the apps that were included there. Now, if you decide to get another Roku TV later down the road, your Roku account does have all the apps that you previously used. And when you sign in, it'll offer to download those apps for you. So as you can see, we are restarting. It's on the splash screen and we should come up to the welcome screen where it offers to uh, go through the setup process as it did when you first purchased the TV. All right, and as you can see, we are at the welcome screen for the Roku TV. So uh, you have successfully reset your TV, you've removed all your accounts, and now it is back to factory settings. So uh, if you return this, none of your information will be on the TV, or if you were to sell this to someone, uh, they will be able to start from scratch on their new TV. Anyway, guys, hope this has been helpful for you. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them down below, and I'll see you guys in the next video.